Hello and welcome back to another growing adventure at Weaver Stonehouse Farms. And this time, we're in the greenhouse. So we're putting in a fan pack IB60, 60 CFM inflation blower. It's only quarter amp, 3100 RPMs. Great. And it's sealed. Also using a VBM bracket round. So it's a blower bracket that matches up to this, okay? So the instructions tell you, use the uh, Titex st stainless steel screws, um, or it included screws with it that had little rubber isolators. This eventually is supposed to go in here and then you twist lock it in place, okay? Now, I did not install this as I should have into the first layer before we installed the second layer of plastic. So now I have to peel that wiggle wire out on the side a little bit so I can reach up in here and cut this and make it fit. And then the blower motor, which looks like this, which that's your adjustment for the amount of air and you gotta use a water tubeometer on it. And you'll put that up there. You'll put the screws that are provided in the kit, tighten her up and let her rip. And that'll pressurize the bubble. So I'm gonna take some wiggle wire off the outside. Got a hole. An X. An X. Not a hole, an X. Oh. Coming in the bubble. Can you get there? Oh, I can get there. Don't you worry. Okay, so I'm supposed to cut an X down through? Yes. Just X. Okay, I'll do it. Okay. That's it. Okay, she's in. There's the hardware. I'm not used to working with tiny nuts. It's small. Okay. <laughs> okay, so work with those little nuts. Five sixteenths. Fits it. It's almost like an eight or a nine millimeter fit it too. It's on. Okay. The adjustment on this is a real crazy wild, you know, screw. <laughs> so that's where you got to go ahead and put inches of water column. I'll have to do a, a tap on this with a manometer, which is no big deal. I know how to do that. If you don't have a water tube manometer, literally get a piece of like vinyl tubing. Silicone tubing would actually work better. Clear. It's clear, clear plastic tubing that you can bend, but silicone works best. And you can take it and literally put it on like a two by four. You could actually tack it up like on your wall. You could put it here, however you want to do it. You could hang it here. You literally can hang it here as long as you have a loop with a U-bend on the bottom measure it with inches you could draw out literally inches on the plastic and that is your inches of water comb and you could do it with the tape measures what you should do obviously um, but the only one is what a quarter inch at the most yeah if i remember right the only one a quarter inch back pressure in this so that is literally a quarter inch it takes a while for this to blow up but i can see we're starting hey i probably should put the stuff on the outside then shouldn't i yeah wiggle let's wiggle Okay, so here it is. It's puffed. It's uh, around about an hour. Hey, if you watched this far, we greatly appreciate it. And hit that subscribe button so we can get to a thousand subscribers and bring you more videos. Oh, yeah. You see it. Okay. I may end up getting more to put them down here because I can see the stresses here. I only put a couple in because I put more of them up top. Okay. Blowers in there blowing away. Let's make an adjustment. I don't have a water tubeometer yet, but we can eyeball it. Because once you get it puffed, it's a matter of just maintaining. 
I'm gonna put it right to that so I can see it. Let's see what happens. Sweet.